Welcome to a two minute wrap of the Intuos tablet. Today we're going to have a look at the Creative Pen, the Creative Pen Touch and the Intuos Pro. The Intuos Pro is also a pen and touch. The major difference between the pen and the pen touch is that the pen only has pen function whereas the pen touch, the tablet itself actually acts like the tracking pad on a laptop. So you've got all those track functions and uh, easy to use touch functions. On the Intuos Pro, we're going to have a, a good look at the product itself. Uh, you've got the stylus, obviously, and you've got more keys on the side for shortcuts. If we have a look at the tablet quickly, uh, you get the stylus in a little stylus holder, so it's all neat and on your desk. Uh, the stylus holder also keeps all your nibs together if you want to replace the front nib on the stylus. On the stylus itself, we've got two shortcut keys over there. Uh, you've got a sensitive nib in the back and you've got your main nib in the front. Uh, the stylus and the, the, the tablet itself, if we have a look at this, you can actually set up and customize everything on this tablet as you need it. So you can give each of these shortcut keys a specific job by setting them up according to whether you want the touch functions on or off, do you want to uh, get to the settings quicker, do you want to scroll or whatever you'd like to do. So if we have a look here, it's very easily and customizable. You can go into your different products. This product is basically going to replace your mouse. Um, it's very easy to use. You're going to take about a week to set up, but after that, you'll probably never turn back to your mouse again. Definitely, definitely a huge advantage to your editing. Good morning. Uh, I'm going to quickly run you through on the. Oh, fuck, fuck. <laughs>